Yes, hello everybody. Uh, my name is uh, Yunus Muhammad Yunus Busweek. I'm from the University Militia Sarawak University. Uh, today I'll give you the second tutorial online tutorial for the biscuit uh, software, which will be the second tutorial uh, to be talking about explaining how to simulate a power system circuit with the single line fault and circuit breaker. So today we'll be uh, simulating one of the circuit or system circuit, which will be we apply the single line fault and uh, uh, solve this problem with the circuit breaker. Okay, first of all, we can look in here for the for the circuit will be the three la three line three phase line uh, circuit I mean, it will be this one to be the three phase uh, voltage source which will be A and B and C with the current measurement and we can find here the three loads will be the resistor load and we can see here how we can apply one fault one single line ground fault to phase C so this ground fault will be happened during the simulating time for the phase line, the single line phase C. So in order to avoid or to solve this problem for the fault, usually in the practical life we use the circuit breaker or the breaker. So now uh, we will check one by one and we will check how we can apply the fault and also in the same time how we can apply the circuit breaker and also to uh, protect the system or the three phase line system or the line uh, three phase line system from the, the fault that will be occurred. So, um, so like we see here the circuit we have that like we see we have three phase it will be three phase view and we have phase A, phase B, phase C it will be the measurement current for the phase A, phase B C for the measurement color and like we say just now we have the three loads which will be everything load one load, load a load b load c and here we have the voltage measurement for a and b and c so now we need to talk about the these two blocks that will be uh, like uh, like controller or to control our fault and also control the second breaker so if you come here for that time fault logic what's mean the time fault logic this one uh, it will give you the option to uh, setting the time and also to uh, to uh, setting the time for the fault to be happening in your circuit so if you click inside here we can find here the time to apply the fault this means what that exactly the actually uh, actually time or the time or the uh, it will become a second the time to apply the fault in the other system so one second this means the second one during the simulation time to be applied the fault the duration of the fault or the duration time of the fault this means how many how, how the many second to be the fault duration of the system during duration that simulating time so in this case we can put here one second this means the fault will be having in the second one and will be for the duration for the two seconds this means the duration for this fault two seconds uh, now we come for the circuit breaker or the time and circuit breaker logic. This one it will be control the circuit breaker to on and off, open and close. As we know, the circuit breaker use it to uh, protect the system or protect the three phase line voltage or protect the utility from the fault earthing fault or single fault. So the circuit breaker we can click in the time and work this one to close. We can find the first one will be the number of the breaker option. That's mean what's mean the number of breaker option? That's mean how many uh, state or how many uh, operation state it will be for this circuit breaker. If you would do this mean you have two operation state will be uh, either open or close. So this one you have to choose two. This mean how many situation for the circuit breaker will be operation. Second one the initial state. Usually the state should be closed. What means it be close? Uh, option to be close or open. Close this means before the fault will be happened, so the circuit breaker should be closed. That means it will be short. That means it will be past the current. So the first state should be the initial state should be closed. So that means before the fault happens, so the system always works normally and the current pass from this three phase 
with the source to the load without any open for the lines. Okay, here the time for the first speaker option. What's mean? This means the time for the circuit to open and time for the second to close 1.2. This means what mean? So, in order to uh, specify this time, second time, we have to know what the time for our fault, what, what the second or what the suitable time or what the specific time to be having for the fault. So, the option here in this graph or in this uh, box or window, it would be based in the time for the fault. As we know just now, we sitting here, the time applied to the fault, this means the fault will be happy in the second one and it will be 0 0.2 second. This means the second button should be start with one, second one, start to be open because the fault will be start in the second one. And this second bucket will be on from the first second when the fault happened until all the duration for the fault. This means it will be one second plus 0 0.2 second. It's going to be all the duration for the second breaker in order to open. So now, here, if you click uh, the run, you can check, you can check the simulation result. Okay, now we can check our result. So the result will be here. If you check here, we can find something. This means before one, this means the fault still not happened until one one point two. This means the duration for the fault is zero point two second. So this fault it will happen between one and one point two. This one showing the fault. And also here we can see this one for the uh, as we know this one for the phase C. Why the phase C? Because the fault happened in the phase C. This one to be for the phase B to be normal. Phase A also to be normal. So the fault just happened in the single line phase C. So we can check here. We can find out the second breaker. Second breaker from this result, we can find out the second breaker already cut or already open from one second to one point two second to eliminate or order to protect the three phase voltage. Uh, thank you so much and I hope anyone who wants to you can email me or you can contact me and the email will be appear in the YouTube. Thank you so much and have a nice day.